Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls with yours truly Lord of the Indirity Mad. Hi Lord of Flows, it's Armage, you're spiffing level 32, boxes to have one, get to stack it, this is 13. And all around neutral guy. This is an old situation, I am only allowed twi twice more in this series. Wait, no, once more, once more. I may not go beyond... 69 deaths, because 69, obviously, it's just not something that can happen, not something that is allowed to happen. How did you get over there? Why are you still over there? Oh, shite. I actually need to heal now. Uh, right, uh, the cleric is also 2,000 souls, so also very much worth killing. I think the bike was easier for stunlocking the busts. Or maybe it was just additional stamina I had farmed from this very venture. right now I am kind of in trouble. Or not. But I will be once I go and try and get the knight again. Maybe I should just get my souls and get out of here. The knight nor the archer really hold anything of very high value for me. So if I take these and just depart. I can level up twice. And that's kind of what this farming thingy is meant for, isn't it? I think I'll put one point in uh, endurance and one in uh, dexterity. To both increase how much stuff I can carry and how much damage I deal. Because katanas only, uh, only scale with dexterity. Cool. I think I may have almost been to the case where I actually had to repair my Uji Katana. That's interesting. Alright, uh, Endurance to 24, Dexterity to 21. We have a deal. Good. Hmm. Right, before I venture on, I'll just, you know, take a, take a little more, take some more souls from here. Just two runs. Hell yeah! So when I said two more times, I may have kind of meant five. Right. Um. But now I should be moving on. I will go and upgrade my pyromancy flame because that's something that is going to save my life on multiple occasions in the future. So I may as well go ahead and upgrade it because. I require that piece of um, jewelry, shall we say? Not shit. I could rest here, but I could just carry on. Uh, doesn't really change anything either way. All right, uh, shield, heavy attack. Then. Heavy attack. Because the shielded heavy attack kills him in one hit and also um, keeps him safe from shit. As in, the attack is actually quick enough to uh, not give them the opportunity to strike me first. I wonder, how does the sprint attack work? Oh! Not as much damage, but still a one hit kill. So, still very, very, very useful. Very, very much so, at least in this situation. Right, turn right. And return to the Undead Parish. Also, I kinda did exploration of Sense Fortress with my other character again. Uh, so, while I still don't know where all the loot is, I know how to activate a transportation system 
uh, and I know how to get uh, some. I I mean I know how to get to where the bonfire leads. That is no longer a mystery to me. I actually know what it does. So there's that. On the other hand, it's time to do some more parish runs. Because parish has always been a nice place. Hi friend. Die friend. You? Die friend. Oh, I accidentally gave him an opportunity to strike. That wasn't very good. Has this sword always been this fast? Because that's pretty fast. The swinging speed, I mean. Oh. Let's see if we can do a little bit of backstabbery as well while we're here. Might be some good extra XP. And flip out of there. I kind of really love to use the word flip as a verb there. God damn it, this is really useful. You just go in, boom, 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 and strike. <laughs> Shit, yeah. I wonder how well that would do in PvP. I don't really do PvP very often, so. I guess we'll see if I should be invaded at any time in the future. That should in fact give me an understanding of how that works. Alright. Keep moving. Now, uh, I also have some souls, the huge ones. And I could feed them to him, but I don't know how much souls they would give if I would just consume them as my own. Oh, hello there. I'm pleased to see you safe, as always. If you provide the materials, I can teach you pyromancy. That's nice. Uh, pyromancy is I think we've had this conversation. Then a pyromancer in yes. my home, you will understand. Okay, so I, no. Modify equipment. What level can I get this to? Level 10! That's nice. Goodbye then. Come back if you find anything new. I need a lot of souls to be able to actually send the thingy. Oh, you're still here. Damn. That stench. And I was really beginning to like it here. Oh, maybe it's time I do something about it. Oh well, it's nice having you around. Uh, uh. How do they get that uh, different sigil there? How do they do it? Uh, how? How do I even? How do I write the message? Just ahead, we're ready for the da. Ah, so this is how this works. All right, I'll put down my own brace the sun. Sure. You now everyone can praise my sun. That's cool. An interesting system. Oh, thanks you. Thank you for this, this flask. Oh, uh, let's wait for another one. Sure, they will kindle it twice. Surely. No? Oh fine, be that thing. Maybe they had already kindled it to... What should I call it? Uh, uh, 15 flasks before? Or maybe they think they need uh, another different ritual to be able to get the fourth one? Get it to 20? Who knows? Or maybe... No, 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 they need to have had the kindling ritual to be able to kindle anything there, because otherwise... Stuff, yeah. And we all know about what they say about stuff, right? 
it's really stuff like true story god I love this animation <laughs> okay going to the bonfire and then I'll start making my way into this into this fortress again because it's a nice place No, I could have used the farm for some levels as well, but uh, on the other hand, I have a plus 10 uh, pyromancer flame, which should actually mean that the pyromancer in the swamp should appear for me. But I don't think I'm going back there until I have the Lord Vessel. Yo, you, one of you, maybe two of you, I don't care. I can take you all on. Of course, I can, on the other hand, just, you know, damage myself instead. <laughs> Take you all on indeed! How did that even happen? <laughs> no biggie. Uh, look at the death count! It's an obvious joke now! Yay! Yay! But I, I suspect that I will no longer get to keep it until the end of the series because I need to die I actually literally have to die in the future which kind of sucks because that still increases my death count while it's plot relevant that I face my demise wait does my sword seriously deal that little damage to you? Or is something different going on? What is it that confuses me so? Oh, you're dead. Maybe they don't really take a lot of damage? Maybe it's just a... Situation that doesn't need me to damage them that much? Maybe? I don't know. Alright, it's bleed that kind of makes this weapon what it is. Alright. Guess I need to put my shield on. And I guess I need to not get knocked into an axe. That sounds like a plan. Run. Don't fall down. All good. Um, right, uh, do you have anything interesting? No, you don't. Never mind. Is there a ball going down this path already? I don't know. I'm gonna try to make my way to safety here. A relative safety, safety. I knew you'd be here. But I don't appreciate you being here before that guy. Oh god, fuck, this is bad. Drink. There we go. Good. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching and I'll continue on with this merry adventure next episode, so I'll see you then. Next time on Dark Zones. Though this guy has a repair again. And I'm apparently terribly bad with repairs. But he has a larger shield, so maybe that is something that might be in my advantage, but who knows, he's dead.